In order to ensure the power quality of the public grid, electricity or electrical equipment must meet the requirements of relevant standards and technical regulations before connecting to the grid, and also obtain a certificate from an accreditation body. A number of electrical and electronic products require harmonic current emission testing in the compulsory standards of various countries. This standard stipulates the limits for harmonic current emissions of electrical and electronic equipment with input current less than or equal to 16 ampere per phase. Electrical and electric equipment is classified as four categories according to the latest ICE standard. Class C is for lighting equipment, and Class D is for equipment which has specified power less than or equal to 600 watts, such as personal computers and personal computer monitors. These two types of products are numerous and frequently used in daily, so there are more strict limits for harmonic current emission. Class B products are used less frequently and have a short single-use time, and the limit is the most relaxed. Class A is a product that does not belong to Class B, C, or D. This IEC standard has been revised in 2020 and will be implemented in 2022. Among them, Class C lighting equipment has the most relevant provisions, and its evaluation of limits for harmonic current is also the most complicated. The evaluation of harmonic current emission depends on accurate measurements and the determination. The IEC 610047 standard clearly regulates the harmonic current emission measurement methods and divides the instruments into two categories according to the measurement accuracy. Class One instruments have high measurement accuracy and can achieve accreditation level measurements of various equipment. And Class Two instruments can be only used for the measurement of harmonic current emission, where the measurement result. Obviously, it does not exceed the limit value, and is only used for general sensors. Therefore, it's recommended to use a high precision harmonic analyzer when performing accreditation tests, or when harmonic current emission is close to the limit value. At the same time, the standard also has various strict requirements for the power supply. Every fine net of M3000 harmonic and frequency test system. As a kind of certified measurement solution, with the advantage of 0.05 centimeter measurement accuracy, 0.1 million ampere high solution, and a special 0.2 percentage low harmonic distortion power supply. In addition to the harmonic current emission test, voltage fluctuations and frequency test is also a mandatory test item in the accreditation. It describes how the fluctuating load. Causes the supply voltage at the point of supply to change, causing the lights to flicker on the same rate. Fluctuating loads include impact loads such as electric furnaces and electric power machines. And some high power equipment will also produce voltage fluctuations when switching. Voltage fluctuations can also cause relays to trip incorrectly, interfering with the normal operation of communications equipment. And other electronic equipment in China. Now we refer to the standard IEC 610003-2005. The standards set the limitation about the voltage fluctuation and flicker of electrical and electronic equipment with rated input current of each phase less than or equal to 16 ampere. Equipment with smaller power generally do not cause that the flicker exceeds the limitation, but flicker is very obvious for big power equipment. In addition to the test of certified harmonic current emission limits, every fine HFM 3000 harmonic and flicker test system is specified designed according to the IEC 610004-15 standard for flicker meter and configures the physical impedance according to the standard requirements. During the test, you can automatically switch the impedance, complete the voltage fluctuation and flicker test with one key, and generate a detailed test report. For more information, welcome to contact with our fine sales team.